Right. Now, in this very video, I want us to consider a very simple aspect of regular astigmatism. Where you're having with the rule astigmatism, against the rule astigmatism, and oblique astigmatism. Okay? Right. Now, in summary, to know the various lens forms and whether they are in the rule with the, with the astigmatism against the rule oblique. Very simple because you will not be given the the the, the, the lens forms in always in minus so you understand sometimes you'll be given in plus so and it's too you to be asked whether you they are with the rule or against the rule oblique and you must be able to do that. So in summary, if it is with the rule, okay, if it is the rule, then you can it is either minus so the minus so should be angles 180 plus or minus 30. That means that the axis should be between 0 to 30, okay? Because 180 is something as 0. And the that we don't have more than 180, than 190, we don't have something like that. So the 80 means 0. Or if I take 30 from this one, I'll get like um, one, uh, 150 to 80. So if I give you any minus cell form, and the axis lie between 0 and 30, 150 to 180, then this will be the rule of symmetrism. Now the plus becomes opposite. So if it is plus cell, then I will have axis 90 plus or minus 30. Are you good? So here, uh, to be, if I take 30 from this one, I get 60 plus 90, I'll get what? 120. So if I'm giving the length, the prescription in a plus cell form, right, and my axis is around between 60 to 120, then they all qualify to be with the rule. Against the rule, I'll give my minus cell form so that it's opposite. So here is for, for with the rule, even the minus 180 is the power, is, sorry, the axis. Here it becomes opposite. So as a result, 90 plus or minus 30. So between 60 and what 120. So if I'm giving minus cell and the axis line between 60 to 120, it's against the rule. If I'm giving um a, sorry, a plus cell, okay, and then the axis line between 180 plus or minus 30 okay it is against the rule so in this case it's just like um 0 to 30 or you can also see it in 150 to 180 it is still against the rule and for oblique for oblique as matter if it's minus so okay like around like 45 as 45 plus or minus 15 that means from um 30 to 60 between 30 and 60 is oblique as a okay if it's if it's still a plus so a plus so axis um 135 okay plus or minus 15 plus or minus 15 that means uh, let's say 120 to 150 so it's plus so it's like 120 150 it is oblique as modern so in short for for with the rule as minus so axis 180 plus or minus 30 that give you the video opposite form of it will be plus so and that will be opposite form so 90 will be, will be 90 so plus or minus 30 uh, that will be around 62, so 120. So I'm giving the plus of form of the prescription and the plus cell. I'll go and check the answers in between 60 to 120. If it is, then it's with the rule. I'll check if it is minus cell. If it's around 180, plus minus 30, the other areas, then it's with the rule of symbolism. I'll check against the rule. Is it minus cell as it's 90, plus or minus 30? If it's, if it's a minus cell and the axis is between 60 to, 60 to 120, it's against the rule. Or opposite form, I might not be giving minus so all the time. I'll be giving I can be giving plus so. So what will I do that? So the further one too, I'll check the as I'll check the, the, the power of this of the cylinder. Is it plus? If it's plus fine, I don't have any problem. I'll go and check the as 180 plus or minus 30. So between 0 and 1 0, 0 and 30 and 150 and 80. If it's lie between that ring, the as lie here, then still uh, it lies it falls under what against the as a matter of and oblique to follows 45 and 25 plus minus 15, so it follows such, such way. So the point is that I do not teach you only one, like if it's only minus lens. I've taught you if it's minus lens and both plus lens. So if it's, if it's plus lens, straight away you can tell whether it's a with the rule or against the rule. If it's minus lens, you can tell. So always have these forms in mind. If it's minus, so 80, the plus becomes opposite form of that. With the rule, if it's minus, against the rule, they are all minus, but with the rule it is around 80, 180, but against the rule is around 90, and things like that. So I think it's very simple for you to understand and um, pass the test very well. Thank you. So you'll be given a, a lens prescription and you'll be asked, is this with the rule asthmatism? 
oblique asthmatism or even against the rule asthmatism. Okay, so in in actual sense, what we mean by the rule is that a man is say a man is say. You see, this is the cornea. Let's say this is the cornea. Okay, a man is say always be on the vertical meridian should be much uh, more or more curved, or so you have the biggest power or the highest power. Okay, so the vertical. All right. So let's say this is the cornea. Okay, the cornea is having vertical meridian and having horizontal meridian. In the embryo, say embryo the ten piano, the vertical meridian should be more curved. If it is more curved, that means that it's having the biggest power. Okay, that means that it's having the biggest power. Right, that is the embryo. In the, if I have any any other or anyone having the cornea with the vertical meridian being more curved, that means it wouldn't run so. So what is with the root asymmetrism? So whenever you have with the root asymmetrism, you know that the vertical meridian is more curved. Now again, the rule is say, I was saying that vertical meridian is more curved. I am more curved. Horizontal moon is more curved. And I am more curved. That means that when you run so, it will go against the rule. Okay, and you have oblique asymmetrism. That lies between with the rule and against the rule. So they lie somewhere here. That is the oblique. They, 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 they lie somewhere here. Okay. So the oblique as madam. So this becomes the oblique as the madam. So now let's go here and know the classification. If I'm given prescription, how will I know whether if this is against the rule, uh, with the rule oblique? Now we have lenses. And we know the lens, some of, some of them are in a plus or form. And others are in minus or forms. Okay. So let's say with the rule as madam. Let's say. What if I'm giving prescription and the prescription is in a minus cylinder form? Okay, minus cylinder form. Oh, the prescription the prescription can be in a plus cylinder form. So what if it is a plus cylinder form? Okay, good. Now let's look. Now here, let's say an example, minus one. Okay. Combine with this is true. Combine with minus one. Axis one eighty plus or minus thirty plus or minus thirty. It's what one eighty. I'm going to say plus or minus thirty. One eighty and one is zero. Okay. So let's say in this case, I need one eighty. You know that you know that this side is one eighty. Okay. Into her, to her, not to her. So when I say one eighty, one is zero. So when I add it, I'll get thirty. Okay. And here two will be uh, one eighty. Here to be what one fifty. So if it's around this meridian, uh, against uh, sorry, you naturally, what I'm trying to mean is that for the minus in that form, okay, we have prescription. No, not a prescription either. Ma, no, a uh, minus one, but it's not a minus zero form. As in a one eighty, and that's a plus or minus thirty. It's one eighty three. Uh, as it's name, and I'm for a for 30 count, and I'm for 30. You see, we are the 30, and I saw we are 30 a film. So, we are the 30, yeah. Okay, we are two ten. No, there be the moment because we know as it's name more than 180. Into 180 means zero. So, if I want to add, if I want to add 30, I'll get 30. But if I want, if I take 30 from it, I'll get 150. Because I just said protractor, I said protractor. Okay, you need a saying in the whole market. The 30 can come in to 10. There will be 180 means zero. So if I want to add 30 to it, I'll get 30. But if I'm taking 30 for it, I will get 150. Instead, as an line within this element, there, yeah, that's a minus lender form. It qualifies to be with the rule as a matter of But your prescription, the minus is a plus lender form. There, yeah. and I'm going to example minus two. Okay, minus two combined with plus one, axis 90 plus. Plus or minus 30. It's in the prescription amount. Now, prescription amount a uh, minus 2 combined with plus 1 and this 90 plus or minus 30. See, when the 30 come in, I'll get 120. If I get if I take it from it, I'll get what I'll get 60. So if it lies, we know so let's return 60 to 120. That's a plus line that yeah, then it is with the rule as a medicine. So with the rule as a medicine, depending on the prescription given to you, check the slender form. Is a minus is a plus. If it is minus, then the cylinder should be the answer should be 180 plus or minus 30. Where I'm getting 30 or 150. But if it's a plus in that form, plus check if it's around 90, 
or plus or minus 30, meaning 60 to 120. If it is, then this thing qualifies to be with the rule as a manager. Now let's go to against the rule as a manager. And then a minus in that form. So let me say an example. Minus 1 combined with minus 1 axis 90. Plus or minus 30. So it's a very opposite form of way, you know. Uh -huh. That means uh, say a minus slender form. Now say as near 90 plus or minus 30, meaning 60 um 60 to um see me if you minus 60 and now 120. So I have against the rule, but we say a minus slender now as near around 90 and plus or minus 30, yeah, against the rule. But has it you higher more higher plus with the rule, no, a higher bear plus that's not a bear 90 plus or minus 30, a bear with the rule. But against the rule, no, when a uh, minus, and then as here 90 plus minus 30, I qualify to be against the rule. Let's go to if this is a plus uh, slender form. So let's say minus 2, okay, combine with plus 1, axis 180 plus or minus 30. And to be in 30, come on, I mean, I say, I mean, 30, you can make it 30, you can make it 30, you can make it 30, 180, 180, but you need lens in 190 or you need to be 180 and 0. And if I want to add 30 with I'll get 30 because I assume zero. But if I'm taking 50 out of it, 30 out of it, like possible, meaning 150. So a line around this scope element, not say a plus and that yeah, any a confirming or say a against the rule as a matter. Let's go to oblique as a matter. Let me say for the minus lender form, minus one combined with minus one axis 45. Okay, plus or minus 15. In this case, you know, only say a uh, minus one, but a line oblique 45 plus or minus 15. In the bit my from 30, and I would make a bit my from 32, in 50 to 60, 30 to 60. Say, as it's an L line from between 30 and 60, now say a minus slender, a uh, oblique astigmatism, straight away, oblique astigmatism. Say a minus form, now say as it's no. A line between 30 and 60 are a oblique as the matter. Now, say so a plus and let me say minus 2 combined with plus 1 axis. Let me say, let me say 135. Okay, plus or minus 15 into plus or minus 15 into we well, the 15 from the 15 I can home. Okay, into the 15 minus a minute like 120. Minute uh, 540. Minus 150. Say a between 120 and 150. That's a plus slender. Okay, for oblique now. Let's say all this kind of range now 120 to 150. A oblique as a matter Into for oblique as a matter no? say a, 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 a minus in that form, a minus in that form now. I send it as near rounding 45 plus or minus 30. To between 30 and 60, no? a oblique between 120 and 180. No? Between, between 120 and 150. And so then oblique as a matter of oblique is uh, very simple. Now for against the rule, no, always check the, the minus if it's minus so check the minus so is it minus one as it's 180 plus minus state. If it is, then it is what with the rule. But over check it as a, a minus so but a 90 plus minus state yeah, yeah, against the rule. In the same way, we check it with the rule, not plus in that form, a yeah, plus one, but as near 90 plus or minus state, so from 60 to 120. That's a, a plus. Uh, now, as near which is 120, uh, it is again, it is with the rule. But over check it, let's say a minus 2, or sorry, let's say the slender, be the slender anyway. The slender is plus 1, but the axis is uh, 180, a line between 0, 30, and one, uh, 150. There, yeah. mm, that region there, yeah, it, conf it qualifies to be against the rule as a matter of One more time, with the rule as a matter of always check the slender. Is it minus or is it plus? If it is minus one, or if it is minus length, but the others is 180 plus or minus 30, that means 30, it can be 30, it can be 20, it can be 10, it can be zero. So between zero and 30, and around 150, yeah, then it qualifies to be with the rule as a matter But say a plus in that form, plus lender, now it has 90 plus or minus 30, yeah, between 60 and 120, yeah, yeah, with the rule as a matter Yeah, but against the rule, so a uh, minus lender form, not saying as is near 90. Plus or minus 30 says a uh, minus one, but as I say, between 60 and 120, yeah, uh, against the rule. Minus two combined with plus one. It's let's say a uh, plus lender form for against the rule, no, but as a slide between zero and 30, 
and at 50 to 180 into say 0 to 30 and at 150 to 180. So as in line between these zones, now as now plus they are uh, against the rule as a matter of oblique so they less around 45 35 to between 30 to 60 and now 120 to 150 there it qualifies to be oblique as a matter of Thank you.